Good afternoon, class. Today we are working on our math work on finding equivalent fractions with a number line. We've talked a lot about the fact that the word equivalent has the word equal in it, so we are looking for fractions that are equal, okay, equal to one another. So if we look at number one, it says using the number line shown, what is the equivalent fraction to one-fourth? Well, first I have to figure out where is one-fourth on this number line. And on this paper, they've been very kind, and every number line has a zero on the left and a one on the right. So we know that we are going to be counting the equal number of spaces between zero and one. How is this number line equally divided into fractions? So if I look at this first number line, we have one, two, three, four equal parts that it is divided into. So my fractions on this number line are always going to have a 4 in the denominator. And the numerator, we are just going to be counting along the line. So we have 1 fourth, 2 fourths, 3 fourths, and squeezing it in, 4 fourths is equal to 1. So it wants to know what is a fraction equivalent to 1 fourth. We just identified that as this one. That's the line that represents 1 fourth. And now if we look down to the next number line, this one, it follows straight along. So this is the same amount as this 1 fourth, but it's been broken up into more equal parts. So let's figure out first what the denominator is of the fractions on the second number line. So I count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 equal parts. So I'm going to put an 8 on my denominator. And if I count over 1 8 2 8 I'm going to get to 2 8 at that mark. So the fraction equivalent to 1 fourth is 2 8 I hope that that is helpful. If you follow that strategy for the rest of this page, I think that you will find that it works every time. Just remember to always start by counting the number of equal parts, making that your denominator down on the bottom of the fraction. Your numerator is the number of parts that you've counted. And then to find the equivalent fractions, you just kind of line it up and figure out where is the line that makes it equivalent, and identify that fraction on each of the number lines. Have a great night. I hope it's helpful.